Good morning. And welcome to the worship and praise of God at United Church of Sun City on this beautiful, beautiful Sunday morning. I am Reverend Brady Abel. It is wonderful to see each and every one of you here today. As we gather this morning, like every Sunday morning, we join our voices and declare together that God is good. And all the time. Amen. Friends, as always, we want to keep in prayer all those listed in the bulletin. I would lift up a special prayer this morning for Chris Pertle. Chris reached out to let me know that she has a very bad case of bronchitis. So we pray for her and we pray for all who are ill this day. We continue to pray for peace, especially in all places of war. And we pray for peace in the hearts of all people everywhere. As always, we pray for joys and concerns that go unspoken this day. We would like to have one more new member Sunday at United Church this year. So if you're interested in joining United Church, plan to stay for worship next Sunday, November 12th, for a time of conversation. We'll meet right up here in this area of the sanctuary. And then on November 19th during worship, we will welcome new members into United Church. Alan, do you have announcements this morning? Where's Alan? Here comes Alan. Good morning. Good yes, morning. There's always more musical adventures coming up at United Church. Uh, just a reminder that uh, later this month, uh, November 19th, is the Tremble Clefs Choir, uh, West Side Tremble Clefs Choir, with their director, Sanju Lee. And we always get a full house, so make sure you make plans and tell your neighbors or family for Sunday the 19th at 3 p.m. And of course, ice cream Sundays afterwards. And then I told you about a concert last week. I hope no one was paying attention because it was, <laughs> turns out it was a pack of lies. We got <laughs> clarification um, from a director who directs several qua uh, bands, so that's what threw me off. Um, we are having a, a group called the Saguaro Saxes, eight or ten saxophones, on uh, uh, performing at our Christmas party, which is... Thursday, December 7th at 5 p.m. And I believe it's a potluck, but I'm not the one that has all the details. But we will have wonderful saxophone music that night. And Very of course, good. our cantata, yes. December 17th. Tell your friends, because we get a full house then, too. Thank you. And more folks this morning with us in the choir. Good to see the choir with us and everybody that's here. Welcome back to our returning snowbirds and to our returning snowbirds and those of you that might be worshiping with us for the first time today. Alan mentioned the uh, All Church Christmas Party. More information will be forthcoming about that, but like he said, Thursday, December 7th at 5 p.m. This morning we celebrate the Sacrament of Holy Communion at United Church. Please know all are welcome at the Lord's table. This morning at the close of worship, we will have a blessing of the bears. We've been collecting the bears for about the last six weeks for our Bless a Bear to Care, um, Bless a Bear to Share campaign. We have 78 bears that we have gathered here. So we will bless those uh, later this morning. And of course, we have to say congratulations to the Arizona Diamondbacks. It was a wonderful postseason. And, you know, at least they finished the season at home. And hey, you know, the Rangers have spring training in surprise, right? So it's like a hometown team won anyway. Okay, moving on. As we do each Sunday morning, let us turn and greet one another with our smiles and our waves. Good morning, one and all. Good morning. And now, if you would please join me in a moment of silence as we center our hearts, minds, and souls on the worship and praise of God. <laughs> 